Right, so just on my way to lose, but he's already laid on couch on Snapchat. Like that? Yeah. I don't think it's a bit much. No, pack that. Me and Lou, we're just like twins, we're like exactly the same. He loves a good drink like I do. When I'm on holiday, I get absolutely paralytic. I get hammered, I pick half-eating kebabs up off the street that people have eaten and left, and I just have an unreal time. He's not one to sit about, like we both just can't deal with boring people. It's all about the here and now, like life. You've got to live it at the moment, you've got to live it to the fullest. Our roles on the trip will be like the party animals, like the drinkers. Always up for banter, always up for a laugh, aren't we? I feel like I can't add to that because you just said everything. So people around here, they can be like quite closed-minded and don't really explore much. You just sort of become like immune to just the same thing every day, same people. So that's why I get out quite a lot, because I do want to explore. I go around houses, I look after older people. The job itself, I do really enjoy, but it definitely gets draining. Going to Spain for me is just going to be like massively different. Hopefully, like meet people like me and Lou, like meet people that Lynn can like go travel with. I also want to meet someone that's like got a bit about themselves and has got a direction like for their life, like they know what they want to do. Because I feel like I'm lacking that because I don't really know what I want to do at the minute. So I feel like they'd inspire me. How are we going to afford four weeks in Spain? I'm just relying on my overdraft and credit card, me. There's a few more drops in that. <laughs> There's a few more drops in that.